What is up guys, welcome back to another Shindo video. Today we're going to do the showcase of the Max Ryan rank bloodline. So before I like to get started, if you're new to the channel, make sure to go down below and subscribe. I'm trying to 8,000 subscribers, become a channel member to support me. All my socials are in the description below and let's carry on the video. <laughs> Alright guys, so we ha let's go for our first move, it's called Rengoku Style Inferno Engage, and this is the first move. This is one of Sasuke's moves that he does against Naruto, like 60,000. Alright, that's a decent amount of damage for that. Alright, I do believe you can move like multiple people towards you and damage them. It's a really good move, like in the anime at least, it was a really good move. And also in here, if you can pull like, I don't know, let's say at least four people, i say yeah, that's a good move to use. Next what we got is Renku style vanishing replacement. And this is pretty much um, a teleportation. So I'm going to stand here and when I use my move, I'm going to teleport uh, uh, to Teru and he's going to come where I am so damage isn't that great but the move itself is unique uh, in order to use it also you need to click on the the player it's all right so I don't know if it'll work with the training log I'll try it on training log right now if there's any difference so nah but yeah it does like 20,000 stuns the opponent bit and that's pretty much it so this is again one of sasuke's moves uh, i forgot what his name is but yeah let's go for our third move rankook style eternal death which is pretty much this uh so i did fifteen thousand, and i don't know what happened to rest so you'll probably see in teru's um perspective on what what happened but i think you put them in a genjutsu and something happens to them it's like let's equip our mode really fast if you look to the right this is how much stats i gain from ryan rangoku this is how it's looking i actually like this uh, design for the mode it's very unique uh, obviously we got the rangoku eyes and stuff and this is how you look like when blocking uh, you got the susano arms like um this how much did i 13,000 for each uh, M1 and with the Q you do, do you like 25,000 which is good as well and now if we use our mode or Z mode this is what it does Now, I couldn't really see what just happened, but I just realized I just hit a lot. Ye how, how, how much did that do? Like, hit half your HP or something? One in four. That's interesting. Alright, so, not only you do so much damage with the Z mode, you also damage, like, a lot. Like, like the AoE so much. Like, I was even damaging this log right here, which is really good. So, in my opinion, Ryan Rengoku is a great bloodline to use. So, if you get it in, in your spins, then definitely keep it. I would say this is re really good for damage wise. I don't know about combo wise. Uh, that's going to be up to you guys if you are interested in building combo with Ryan Rengoku. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like down below. If you haven't subscribed, I'm trying to 8,000 subscribers. I want to thank my channel member for supporting the channel. If you'd like to become a channel member yourself and you want to see your name right here, click the join button, next subscribe button. All my socials are in the description below and I'll see you later. <laughs>